everyone. I'm Bob Ide, host of the Great Outdoors TV show. Well, it may be cold outside, but it's warm in here as we bring together over 100 outdoor vendors, showcase for you to see everything that there is to do in the outdoors. Welcome back to the Riverfront Sports Complex in downtown Scranton as we bring you a preview of the Great Outdoors Expo and the other highlight we have once again back will be the Hog Fishing Tank 2 and this year we have Doug Strickland on there again who was here last year and we brought in a very special guest, Marsha Rubin, one of the top female bass anglers in the United States. Marsha and Doug, welcome to the Great Outdoors Expo. Thanks a lot for coming. Thank you for having us. Doug, let's talk about you. Let's talk to you first before we get to Marsha. You were here last year. You had great response. Uh, what can they see up on the tank this year from you? We're going to see a lot of the same things we saw last year. We're going to talk about some, some new techniques that are coming out for the year. Um, we're going to talk about uh, the, the float and fly, some spring techniques, some, some jerk baits, some moving that real slow, which is something that at the pro level, Marsha and I deal with every weekend. You know, never does a pattern very uh, stay the same on a Friday, Saturday, or a Sunday. You've constantly got to be watching what those, those weather patterns are doing. Marsha, thanks for coming. Uh, top 12 in the country right now. You finished you're going to be in the championship for the tour. Mm -hmm. Tell me how the last year went and then tell me how you got into the championship. Tell me how your year went. Uh, the last year actually got off to a pretty rocky start. My daughter ended up having emergency surgery mm -hmm. during the very first tournament and I ended up finishing in like 89th place, which was <laughs> terrible. Yeah. I've never had such a poor finish. Um, but you know, I, I rebounded from that and I had consistent high finishes after that with my highest finish being seventh on Kentucky Lake. And so the remainder of the tournament season, I just kept on having these very high finishes, which put me in a 12th spot overall. So you'd be fishing in the championship in February, right? Yes. That's yeah. amazing. You excited about it? I'm really <laughs> excited. I mean, there's only 11 of us or 12 of us mm -hmm. that are fishing. So, you know, I have like a one in 12 chance of actually yeah. getting the crown. I mean, that's, yeah. that's what we all dream of is, is winning the championship. It's like, I mean, that's a national title. and. I'm just really excited. I'm <laughs> yeah. really excited because really um, I'm a rookie. Mm -hmm, you are. And I'm learning and I'm an avid learner and I love to learn and I've kind of surprised myself with how consistent I've been. And you've, you've had consistent results for just a short amount of time you've been bass last, fishing. Yeah, the last two years. My, my rookie year I finished in 20th out of almost 130 ladies and then mm -hmm. my second year I finished in 12th. So. There you go, one of the top 12 anglers in, in the world. Quickly, tell me about a little bit about what you're going to talk about up on up on the uh, hog fishing tank. Well, I'm really excited. Um, this is my first tank, summer, and I love to talk. I love mm -hmm. to talk about fishing. As Doug knows, we talked about three hours last night on the phone. Um, but my seminar is going to be about being versatile, and the title of the seminar is "Versatility: The Key to Better Bass mm -hmm. Fishing," and really, it's all about all of the different types of presentations that you can fish with and then also not just that but how to modify those presentations. She has a very interesting story so if you get to meet Marsha ask her about how long she's been fishing uh, I'm sure you'll, you'll be, get touched by it. Marsha thanks for coming. Thank you. We'll see you again. Doug good luck you guys have fun up there right? Always oh, yeah. every year. Okay. Look forward to the show. Thanks.